hello friends welcome to my channel this is Charan in this video I will show you how to bind the files from the project folder and delete using drop down list control now you got a new output now we'll delete the apples.jpg delete so notice here the selected files apple.jpg is successfully deleted let's check in the folder solution explorer show all files see here the apples.jpg is deleted if you are a first time visitor to my channel please subscribe to get the latest updates right now in this aspx source page contains a simple html5 code with some HTML head tags H1, H2, and horizontal line. After horizontal line, I am adding the drop down list control and one button control to, to delete the files from the drop down list control. Go to toolbox, drop down list control, go to toolbox, button control. In the button control, the property text button, I am changing to delete and also I am adding one label control. The property text from the label, I am deleting. Now the next step is, I will create a folder in the project and I will add some images. Go to solution explorer right click add new folder drop down images it's a folder i'm adding images in this folder right click add existing item from the desktop in the image folder I'm selecting eight images add and here the images are added in this folder drop down images now the coding part right click view code I'm adding namespaces using system dot Ivo and using system dot collections now in this page load event I'm adding directory info class directory info di is equals to new directory info map path and in this map path I'm adding my drop down images folder name rename copy that one between double quotes tilt file info class which is an array fi is equals to di dot get files it's a method array list al is equals to new array list I'm adding for each loop file info info in fi a1 dot add info I'm adding the files into this array list after that I'm binding the records to the drop down list control drop down list one which is a drop down list id dot data source the source we are getting from al which is an array list and the last one i'm binding the drop down list data bind let's check the output before writing the deleting part google chrome and here we got the output and notice the image files are binded into this drop down list control let's switch back to the coding part we'll write the delete functionality for this drop down list control 
and stop debugging. Switch to the source mode, design mode. Double click the button control. And here we got the button click event. Now in this button click event, string file name is equals to the file name you are getting from the drop down list control. Drop down list one dot selector item dot text. Now I'm writing the path string file path is equals to server dot map path between double quotes now in this double quotes I'm adding the folder name tilt drop down images plus file name file info file is equals to new file info which takes the file path this variable if file dot exists if the selector file is available I want to delete that file file dot delete method and the last one I want to display the message label one dot text is equals to selector file plus plus drop down drop down dot selector item dot text is successfully deleted make sure there is no gaps that's it now it's time to check the results in the browser google chrome Now let's delete the file. I want to delete the apples.jpg. When I select, notice when I want to delete the apples.jpg, the file animal1.jpg is deleted. Let's check in the folder Solution Explorer. Show all files. See, animal file is deleted. The item animal1.jpg does not exist in the project directory. It may have been moved, renamed or deleted. The reason why the first item is deleted from the drop down list is in the page load event when the postback occurs is binding the drop down list control. So if not is postback copy this and paste here now we'll check the final results google chrome now we got a new output now we'll delete the apples.jpg delete so notice here the selected files apple.jpg is successfully deleted let's check in the folder Solution Explorer Show all files See here the apples.jpg is deleted That's it